everyone welcome back to my first voiceover video so these days I'm just doing a speed art video so today finally after many of my friends and people just told me to make a voiceover video so it will be much better what I'm actually doing so I uh, never have planned this but suddenly it just came up and yep uh, my last video was I what it was just a mistake so I just postponed it and I just instead of that video I just uh, uploaded this video um, I mean just I'm just overriding this video you could say and yep so today I'm going to create this concept you can see on my screen and it will be very easy and I'm going to maintain the theme of uh, winter scream and all so I just cons I just have the concept on my mind, but I don't know what will be the result. So we're gonna start from scratch. So how I just do everything. So let's get started. So today I'm going to uh, select this document size, which is web large, 1920 1080p pixels. So just clicked, and my document is ready. And now we're gonna go to the Google Chrome, and we're gonna type. Winter, a uh, snow landscape, snow landscape, minimal. And here we can generate so many ideas uh, how we will make the concept. All right, so here's the basic concept. So we just got, and now, uh, so we, what I do most of the time, people search in Pinterest, but uh, from my bandwidth. Uh, Pinterest is blocked for no reason and now let's get started so at the first it's the empty document and I'm just going to do rectangle tool and I'm gonna drag over here it will be a base layer right now you could say and now I'm gonna create some mountains so it, it's it's not that much quite hard but it's very easy and very super simple just you need to have a little bit you know you have to be comfortable with it will be illustrator and I guess we're just hurting the clicking sound which is very messy I know I'm sorry for that <laughs> okay so our mountain is ready now I'm gonna make it I'm gonna scale this up and yep we're done so in here you can see there's a mistake I can see clearly on my eyes and which I cannot avoid it okay so it's done and we're gonna create another mountain layer it will give a little bit you know dynamic feel of the illustration okay now it's done we're gonna select the move tool now the selection tool by pressing B on the keyboard and I'm just gonna drag this up and I'm gonna push back behind it so how we can do control shift and open bracket it's been behind over every layer and I think we are pretty much done and now we're gonna make a pine tree so let's make it so you're gonna make like this okay now here I think it won't be very problem now our concept is very much clear now 
and I'm gonna play with the color so what I'm thinking it will be very on the night scheme so for that I'm gonna add some another layer to make it a little bit give a life on the illustration okay it's the font really uh, it's a front layer I'm gonna bring this very front and now we're gonna make moon here so uh, we will create this later and now let's uh, match up the color now in this time I'm gonna make sky and now let's choose the color so we can change later the color but let's the cho let's choose first I'm, I don't know I'm just nervous now I'm not good at talking even though okay we are now good and we're gonna create one more rectangle and let's put the gradient and let's select from here and let's select from here oh my god I just did the mistake okay let's choose from here and now select the sky layer I drop a tool and just drag it over here and select the gradient tool again okay and now let's match up the color a bit so it will be very impressive and And for the mountain layer, so let's select, uh, let's make this first. And now select, we're gonna select the mountain layer and we're gonna play with this color. Let's make it white. And a little bit brighter, okay. And now select we're gonna use the same color so if there is needed so we will change it uh, according to you know uh, for the eyes and for attractive reason Okay, let's look at the reference image I so, uh, saw somewhere. This one. Okay. Oh, for now. Okay, let's play with some multi color and let's see how actually this works. And also what I did here I just uh, made a bit, I'm just making a bit of adjustment uh, to match our the illustrations to the best and for now let's add some uh, let's add a star to give as a Christmas bride Christmas vibe okay let's uh, make it random something like that and Let's bring forward 
No, I think it's okay. <laughs> it's not working like that. Okay. Yep. That's good now. And I think we need to make it very small. Yeah, we are good now. And now let's uh, make it uh, something closer to yellow. And I think it's bright it's enough now. And it's too much bright, so let's adjust it. Okay, it's not perfect for me. And now for this layer, we also need to do a little bit of adjustment. Okay, it's perfect for me right now. I think I don't need any changes now. Okay, for now we're gonna make a bit of glue. So how we can do this? We can uh, copy this, Control C, and Control F to place it over here. And now we can scale up, and let's bring very forward, and let's go to the filter, and we're gonna choose the blur, Gaussian blur. And now we're gonna scale this up higher until looking glowy but there are a lot of ways we can make this glow effect you can use uh, by adding the gradient so but I'm gonna make I'm just thinking of to make like you know um, two on the shape and okay for now we're gonna add some uh, what is called screen I forgot yeah blending mode so let's, I'm gonna add some blending mode right now and let's see what I can play with it. Okay, so I just set to the overlay, it's look very good for me. And let's bring everything forward. Okay, so we are good now. And yeah, so it looks very good for me. Uh, for right now, we're gonna add moon over here, which already mentioned before. And let's make a moon. Uh, for scale, just keep in mind to make it uh, to keep as a realistic sizes and all. And let's copy this one, Control C, and place it, Control V. And we just we we have two moon, and now we're gonna scale up. A bit okay. Now we're gonna add to, go to the effect, and let's add blur, Gaussian blur, and let's scale up until we are satisfied. Okay. Now let's go to the blending mode. And let's add the light end and scale down a bit. Okay, now now let's reduce the opacity and let's make it backward. And scale up a bit. Now we are pretty much done. And yep, that's the video. It's pretty much cold, like outside. And okay, let's add some stir. We just done the basics uh, for the, our main person. Now we're gonna add some extra thing. You could add Santa Claus uh, here and there. You can add some person, whatever you like. And now for my in this video I'm gonna use stars. For okay, so how just I create the stars? So let's uh, I just like the brush tool. Uh, where it is? Yes. So we just choose the brush paint brush tool, and I just once I select it, so I just click massively the hair and they're randomly like a star. There are a lot of ways you can create uh, the star, but 
I always use this method. So okay, so let's select this all every stir and let's make it group control G and now we're gonna place down here and let's it make very front and now for the stroke we're gonna put more color white and here we can see in the moon layers we're gonna delete uh, some of these stars bam yeah just now we're done and uh, let's select all control G make it group and I'm gonna clip out I'm just I'm gonna mask out everything so let's make a rectangle and select the grouped illustration let's make it clip mask bam which is done so this is the video for today and thank you for watching and yep I know it's not it wasn't really good uh, in video and quality and it can leave your suggestion and your feedback and anything I appreciate you any comment and for the support hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and I really appreciate you those who are supporting from the beginning and yep uh, Thank you everyone. So this is the video and yeah. And yep, if you need any illustrations, don't forget to reach me following links at create.xyz. And yeah, thank you and see you. Stay safe, stay home, and I'll see you the next time. Thank you.